welcome back to my channel. Today we are going through my dresses, which is why I have one on right now. So I've been really wanting to clean out my closet, and I mean like clean it out. I mean I have done really big aggressive clean outs before. I think I've cleaned out my closet maybe three times on this channel, and you guys really like it. But right now I'm thinking of actually getting rid of... 75% of my closet. Dresses are one of those things that I feel like I say I never have any dresses and then I buy cute dresses that I see because in my mind I still don't have a dress collection and I realize I'm pretty sure I have like 30 dresses so <laughs> I need to definitely dwindle that down. So let's just go ahead. My closet's over here. I'll bring y'all in there so you can check it out. The lighting's not the best though so we may have to switch back to out here. Here is my closet. I love this closet and it's a really good size. As you can just see though, the lighting is really, really yellow. So I'll show you my dress section, which is over here. And then we'll probably move the dresses out. So the lighting's better. So here's basically all my jackets and cardigans and whatnot. Ugh. I do need to go through those soon with fall around the corner. This is just like my letterman from high school. I don't ever know if you should throw things like that away, but whatever, I'll just keep it for now. Let's count. Thirty-one including the dress that I am wearing. That is what we have to go through. Now there are a bunch of different kind of dresses, so I don't necessarily want to put like a limit on how many I keep. Like I'm partly tempted to say, oh, I'm only keeping 10 or five, but we have like more formal and then more casual and then like workout dresses. So I feel like I can't just like set a number on it, but let's go ahead and pull these out. So here is the first dress that I have on, and I believe this is a dress I got from Shein. I will be keeping this dress. I really like it. I just like it as a nice casual dress, and it's tie-up, so all of it is super adjustable. Also ones that I bought online, I will link those down below. Like. I know I can link this dress if I want. I just ate, so I mean, it is hugging the belly a little bit. I like that it cinches. I just wear like a sticky bra with it, which I also got from Shein. So this is the next dress. It's like a dress slash romper. I absolutely love this. And I got this from Marshalls, I think, for like $10, which was such a steal. And I kept it for so long just because it is so unique. So it basically has these built-in shorts that go all the way around and they're a good length and then this little cape that goes but it goes all the way around so it kind of looks like a dress like a maxi dress from behind but then forward and I do really really love this I also like that it's see-through on the cinch and I think it just cinches, cinches really nicely it's very flattering for the body but I wore this recently and so it's just one of those things that's like I found an event to wear it I had it for like five years like I've had it forever and never wore it so I wore this to a friend's wedding in June and it was like an outdoor wedding very hot so this was perfect because it was like formal but breathable and then I remember I put my hair up, I threw on some wedges, and I had like dangly earrings. Oh, also, I think I'm just going to put the stuff I don't want on Poshmark. So if anyone wants this, um, I will be putting this on Poshmark as well as all the sizing descriptions. It also cinches right here with two navy buttons. That's what holds it around the neck. But yeah, it's so comfortable. It's nice and breathable. Again, wearing that same sticky bra. So, And although I love it, it will be leaving because like I said, I've already worn it. A lot of people have seen it. I got kind of like my statement with it and now I need to part with it. Next is this dress, which actually I got this dress from Just Fab, which they're known for selling shoes, but they also have clothing. And I just love it because it's basically just all see-through lace. Now here it does have like a skin tone. When I say skin tone, it's just tan because it's not necessarily everyone's skin tone. But the idea, I guess, is um, this is covered and then this is actual like just lace. Like your skin shows through the sleeves. But I just really like this and the back is really pretty and I just like how I feel in this. I actually wore this 
before, but I feel like it's kind of a staple piece so I can keep it. But I wore it to, Taylor had a formal for his, his pharmacy fraternity and the theme was like Great Gatsby and I didn't have like a flapper dress or anything. So I did this and I curled my hair and I did red lipstick and with black strappy shoes and I thought that was really fun. So although I've used it before, I feel like it's just like black lace dress, it's a good staple. I'll probably keep this. Alright, so here is a, another one. I will show y'all. It's just a long black dress that cinches here. It's got a V neckline and thick straps. And this is a good one. I'm honestly kind of on the fence about whether I want to get rid of this. Just because it is like plain and neutral and safe. Um, but I've had it for years and years. I did wear it once to a wedding. It's just a cotton dress. It is really like soft and flowy and breathable. So I like that. I like that I can wear a regular bra with it. And it's like conservative but still flattering. So I do think I'm going to be getting rid of it. Just because like I said I've worn it already. And I'm just kind of getting a little bored with my closet, so this one will be going bye-bye. Alright, so I'm not sure if this is see-through, so I just kind of put my hair over it. <laughs> um, but I do really, really like this dress. I am well aware that I'm not necessarily the uh, body type for this. I need a little bit more oomph up here, but I figured that's what boob tape is for. I've never used it, but I feel like I could totally like tape them up to be a little perkier, give a little bit more going on here and not so flat chested. This dress is gorgeous. It's completely out in the back and has these really long, 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 long strings. I just love this color so much. I kind of feel like the adult version of Tinkerbell in this outfit. <laughs> I think it's just really cute. I wish I had the body and the confidence to wear this out. Um, I will still be keeping it though because just the inner glam person in me really wants to think that one day I will wear this. So I will be keeping this. For this one I can assure you it is not inside out. It's just that trend where the seam shows. This is so soft. Like I want to say this is suede or at least a version of suede. I'm not sure if suede is expensive but I don't think this dress was. Um, but I do think it's fun. A little turtleneck halter top action. Of course I love green. It's my favorite color. And it's short and fun and the material is nice, but I've had this in my closet for years. I've never worn it. I just always grab something else instead. So I think I will be parting with this dress. All right, so this next dress is also from Shein and Ties. And I do really like this dress, but I feel like it is pretty similar to that other one I have. So I think I will be getting rid of this. I also wore it for Valentine's Day last year. So I just kind of got my use out of it and I already have one floral dress. Actually, I have more than one, but one that I for sure know I'm keeping. So I am going to pass this along, but it is really fun. It's nice and cotton. It's breathable. Again, I feel like it's a conservative dress that's also like a little fun because it cinches and it's a V-cut, but you still have like the cap sleeves. You can wear a normal bra. It's not too like plunging of a neckline. Also, something I didn't notice, so I put this on. I don't think it's cut even. Like this side looks higher than that side. And it is a little wrinkled and stuff, but even when it lays flat, like I don't, I don't know if that was the style of this dress. I don't think it was. Or at least if it is the style, it doesn't look like it's supposed to be. It kind of just looks like I had a funky tailoring job. So another reason why I will be getting rid of this. All right, now this one is just a classic like t-shirt dress. I did wear this to some football games and I did like some senior photos in it, like high school senior photos. So it definitely has gotten its use and so I think I am gonna part with it. This dress I love. Now it is extremely short and I wore this for a college formal. But I do just really, really, really love this dress. I would wear a different bra with it because this one it kind of goes a little too low. Like it keeps trying to catch that. Um, I also got this from Shein. I think for like 8 or $10 or something. But it's just so fun. It's actually really good quality. Zipper up the back. Just all red. I just think it is so 
fun and feisty. So now we have a, another dress and I do really, really like this dress, but I think I'm gonna be getting rid of it because it is so tight on the boob area. Like it fits good on the waist and down here and I think the color is so pretty. If you can't tell, I like lace with like colors that peek through. I will be getting rid of this, but isn't it so fun? Like I just think the way it's fitted is really flattering. I don't actually know what kind of bra I would use for this or if I would just do like little sticky pads because it's like it pokes through right here. This is also very short and it has the back out but I kind of like it. It's just like you know a little black dress. I feel like you always need to have some of those in your collection. Okay so you can see my sticky bra because it like laces up in the middle but I made it to where the seam was like even all the way across and to do that this would have to be so low um I don't know I think I'm actually gonna pass on this one I think I have another black dress that I can keep all right so this one you can see the bra again but I think I wore a different one and got away with this I think this is the black dress that I will keep. This is American Eagle, I believe. It's a little wrinkled too. It's been in the closet for a while, but I actually wore this for like my college graduation photos. I did a bunch of shots in this, but I think it's just such a good black dress to have. And it's a little bit longer, so I feel a little bit more comfortable in it. And it still cinches and does the deep neckline, so I feel like you get the same idea. Um, like I said, I'd wear a different bra, so you, so this could go all the way down. But yeah, I really like this dress. I'm pretty sure I got it um, at like Uptown Cheapskate or something like that, or Plato's Closet for like eight dollars. So it's a good one. So for this dress, I actually got this at Marshalls, and I misspoke earlier. This is what I wore for Valentine's Day this year, since we couldn't like go anywhere with COVID. For Valentine's Day this year, Taylor and I cooked at home and we did like a charcuterie board and appetizers and like it was a lot of fun and we got dressed up and so I had gotten this at Marshall's forever ago and I never wore it out because it's actually like it kind of shows everything like it shows underwear lines and like if you eat it pooches out and it shows all your bra lines so it wasn't really crazy about it but for us just to be like sitting at home I was like oh like you know dressing up at home red dress it's fun and festive so this will be going though because it's just not the most ideal and actually going out but it's a good dress it's just not really for me anymore i used to love this dress now i feel like it's a little bit frumpy um i think that just was the trend when i bought this was just have flowier clothes i've had this for years <laughs> And I did think it was fun. I think I've worn it out and about before with some wedges. So it has gotten some use and it's not really my style anymore. So I think I will be getting rid of this. But it's kind of cool because it has these little straps here. And you can kind of like wear it as a tank top. And then it cinches and it's flowy. And I mean, the cinching and stuff is nice. It also ties right here. And yeah, it's a good dress. Just not really my style anymore. So I will be getting rid of it. I think this dress is so fun. I would also wear a different bra with it because it's really picking up all that lace up right here on the strapless bra. And luckily with the thick straps, you can kind of get away with that. But I really, really like this. I actually got this for a wedding that I went to. I love maroon. I'm an Aggie, so I feel like I always got to keep a good amount of maroon in my closet. And this is just such a fun dress. I think I got this from Marshalls for like $10. So what a steal. This dress I love. I always love green and this is just a nice soft cotton dress. I love long sleeve dresses. It's just a thing of mine. I've worn this a good bit. I probably should part with it but I like it too much so it is going to be staying. But yeah I love this. Again another Marshalls find so I think I spent like $15 on it max but love 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 now this dress i am definitely keeping this is a wrap dress and i feel like you can't really go wrong with wrap dresses because they really cinch you in this is very stretchy and heavy material but it makes me feel like i'm just like rocking spanks i just love this dress and no i'm not the curviest girl this would probably look a little bit more flattering if i had more for it to hug but i do like it a lot and i think it's a great way to kind of be dressed sexy but in a professional 
environment. So I actually, I think this is a great like dress if I needed to go to like a nighttime, like a work event that's like, I don't know, like a Christmas party or something and you want to be like professional and mature but also just like, you know, a little bit because it's got these thick straps and stuff so it's not too much and it's a V but it doesn't go too low and then it's tight but it's long so it just, I feel like it, you could get away with it looking a little bit more appropriate but still be, you know, sleek and flattering and I actually wore this to my business org when I was in college, did like a masquerade party, ball formal thing. And so I wore this and just had like my mask and I thought it was pretty cool. This dress is super fun. I actually wasn't able to zip it up all the way on my own, but I do really like it. It has this really cool pattern to it. I don't know if it's picking that up. It kind of reminds me of like, I mean, some may say tires. But it kind of makes me feel like I'm in like a superhero costume. You know like when they're real tight but they have like some kind of like, I don't know, net looking mesh to them. Like I feel like I'm in like a Spider-Man outfit or something. But I really like it. I like the length of this dress. I just think it's flattering and it's just a twist. You know, it's just a simple black dress but then has a twist to it with this like texture and the lines and stuff. And yeah, I just really, I really like it. I think it's a good just go to black dress to keep in the closet. All right, so I definitely have things to say about this dress. Uh, it's very see-through, very thin, it's very tight. I feel like it's grabbing things, not very flatteringly. It's not that I couldn't get the zipper up. Well, like size-wise, it is like a really cheap metal, so it just gets stuck and it's hard to move. So I just wanted to move on from it, but my idea when I saw this was it kind of reminded me of that dress that Bella Swan wears when she's leaving her wedding and going to her honeymoon, and I just thought that dress was gorgeous, and this is what it reminded me of, but quality is not there, so I am going to have to say goodbye to this dress, which is very unfortunate. Oh my gosh, guys, I had to fight with this dress. It is so unbelievably tight and it's not actually that bad like on the stomach and the legs and stuff it's like my chest it's in the arms like I kind of feel like I'm in a straight jacket and like it's hard to breathe so I'm gonna get out of this ASAP but yeah don't care for this I think I got it because it's just like ooh red dress that's fun and you know I love long sleeve dresses but this is not it guys I have twig arms so if something's tight on my arms that's really really concerning like I don't know what body type they made this for but I feel like running out of breath. All right, on to the next. All right, so it's nice to go to a dress that's actually breathable now, but I really like this dress. I think this was another one that I got from Marshalls, and it's just short and fun, and it's quarter sleeve, I guess you would say, um, and it cinches right here, which is really fun, but it's this cool, like, suede material, and this dress is just awesome and it's like green but then also has like a silver to it and I just feel like it's really fun it kind of gives me like cottage core vibes I know cottage core I think it's supposed to be lighter colors like whites and tans but I feel like this kind of fits with it and it's just fun and new and unique so I think I am going to hold on to this the only thing is I wish the neckline was a little bit different like I wish it was more of a V neckline I personally don't like circle necklines as much or oval because they're just not very flattering for me but other than that this is such a cool dress like when it moves I just think it's cool it catches the light now time for this dress I really really like this dress I recently got this my mom actually gave it to me and I just think it is so fun and sweet and girly I think it may have too much white to be able to wear it to a wedding but I did wear it when we went on the wine walk in my hometown and that was a ton of fun and I just think it's so fun and cute I guess this is probably more cottagecore than the last one yeah definitely keeping this all right now for this dress this dress is fun and I do really like the color I'm kind of on the fence about it like I don't dislike it but it's not like my absolute favorite but I did wear this for Taylor's white coat ceremony before he started pharmacy school and he really likes this dress and he's told me that multiple times that he likes his dress on me so I think I'll keep it just for him and maybe I'll wear it if we go like date night or something 
just since I know he likes this dress on me. <laughs> this dress still has the tag on it. I'm just kind of on the fence about this dress because it is a little bit big for me and I don't really think it's worth tailoring. So I think I am just going to keep the tag on it and pass it along. But I do think the color is so cute and fun. The issue is this is the smallest size the store had at the time and so I took it hoping it would work. And I'm too lazy to take it back to the store, so I'll just give it to someone else. So this dress is so extra, and I'm just on the fence of whether I like it or not. Like, I don't know. Like, it is so pretty, and it kind of gives me, like, a 90s vibe, and, you know, 90s are in. Although, I feel like you could also pass for 80s. <laughs> I don't know. I'm kind of on the fence about this, but I do think it is so fun. And the strap is nice and thick. It just stays right there like i don't feel a lot of movement um so because it's fun i'm gonna keep it will i ever wear it i don't know but as of right now i'm excited all right i didn't realize this was the last dress when i tried it on so now i'm doing a whole outro <laughs> with this i do have two more dresses but i'm actually not gonna try these on because they're like workout dresses and i know i'm keeping these i got these from halara i will post that video link it here and down below because these are really cool. They have like built-in sports bras and spandex and their workout dresses. So I count these in the dress collection. But they're not like like dress dresses. They're like workout. And like if I go play golf or tennis, like I like to wear these when I go with Taylor. So yeah, if we include these, I kept 15 dresses. 13 if we aren't including the workout ones. And then I got rid of 16. So I got rid of one more than I kept. <laughs> and like I said, I didn't necessarily have a goal of what I should keep and not keep. I just really wanted to clear stuff out and get rid of things that are storing on my closet that I just know I'm not gonna wear. Alright guys, that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. Also, hope you like, comment, subscribe down below, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye! So he's like, come outside. And he had this neon yellow poster and he had a sunroof. And he was standing outside with his skinny jeans and his band shirt. And it said, will you go to homecoming with me? Well, my dad comes flying out the front door. <laughs>